the ups and downs of entertainment's comeback in 2022, fans went to film festivals and concerts to catch a glimpse of their favorite celebrities, like Timothy Chalamet in Italy, Harry Styles in Toronto, and Paul McCartney and Kendrick Lamar, who triumphantly returned to the stage at the Glastonbury Festival. A hero's welcome was extended to Taylor Swift when she appeared at Yankee Stadium in a cap and gown to greet New York University graduates months before her tour smashed Ticketmaster records. Movies surged back to life. Tom Cruise gave the industry a big shock with Top Gun, Maverick, complete with a high-flying advertising tour that traveled the world and brought back even reluctant moviegoers. Additionally, Jeff Goldblum made a comeback, this time for Jurassic World, franchise that demonstrated that, indeed, films would discover a way. The comedian biopic, musician starring Daniel Radcliffe, and Weird Al Yankovic, demonstrated that this route frequently involved a combination of theaters and streaming. Despite all the great points, there were many darker ones as well. By slapping Chris Rock on live television, Will Smith upset the Oscars and created one of the most memorable pictures of the year, as rap television viewers watched. Johnny Depp and Amber Heard's defamation trial offered an unflattering glimpse into their marriage and many terrible moments. Quinta Brunson, the adored creator and actress of Abbott Elementary, won an Emmy, but Jimmy Kimmel's appearance on the Emmy stage while acting asleep overshadowed everything. However, there were plenty of other things to smile about. Steven Spielberg grinned as he walked the Oscars red carpet as Rita Morno and Ariana DeBose shared a tender moment as Anita in two very different productions of West Side Story. After a protracted period of uncertainty and gloom, elegant, colorful, and occasionally quirky fashion was on show on runways and at superstar premieres.